Good morning. So why I hate vlogging? If you follow my videos lately you can see that I'm posting some stuff that's like well-rounded, it has a beginning and a conclusion. And uh, I mean I'm pushing myself to get there and to have videos with good stories. And since spring and summer is here I will go out a lot more and I will record a lot more videos and I need to figure out something how to make my vlogs more interesting. I don't even know why I'm talking to the camera because I'm in a hurry so... Do you guys remember Flo from my old vlogs? He kind of changed since the progressive commercials. <laughs> we are going in DC. See you there. So I just got to DC about half an hour ago and I still have no clue what the hell am I doing here and uh, I think this just uh, reinforces the theory that improvisational vlogs are just not for me and uh, I'm here right next to the to the monument and there's a concert here next to me so let's check that out that's the concert <laughs> but apparently Behind these chairs, there'll be a cherry blossom festival, which which I'm gonna see today, because I'm lucky. But first, I'm gonna go all the way down to the Lincoln Memorial. What about this? Never used it. New experience. Let's go. Let's do this without fucking up my camera. Without fucking up my camera. Casey Neistat style with the freaking bandy tripod. And um, I told you guys that I have a new tripod, right? <laughs> it's time to use it because I just don't want to buy another thousand dollar camera. I'm not Casey. I cannot put my money into this. So let me reach out that cool scene that I just tried to, to capture three seconds ago. So the camera is here, the road is there. I'm using my good tripod and I will take my freaking scooter and I will come down this way. <laughs> Welcome back. I was kind of ignorant with these electric scooters and electric skateboards but this is cool. I never really tried it because it's just too expensive and I don't want to try something fun that's expensive because I know that I'll buy one. And of course, we don't have these cool scooters where I live, because uh, I live in a village. I live in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. <laughs> okay, like after two hours and the camera fall later, I'm here and uh, I'll change my lens to get some, some better shots. It's just so good sitting here and doing nothing. I should do this more often. <laughs> and the reason why I'm upset because there was a pretty good application to connect my Samsung to the Canon and uh, this is not working anymore. And when you are your own photographer and you are the photographer and the model too, uh, a freaking app like this can be really useful. And uh, Android and Canon just please don't mess up something that's working. I feel that I just brought too many things with me and uh, my bag is too heavy so I'm kind of exhausted. But still, let's go back to the Cherry Blossom Festival. Tickets are like 50 bucks but I will try to sneak in. And from there I need a coffee. I need a coffee and a breakfast because it's already like 11 o'clock. I have a girlfriend. <laughs> Thank you. 
I just realized that I forgot to talk about uh, why I hate vlogging and uh, I think the reason I think the reason for this is because I kind of enjoy it I'm just running around I'm recording stuff I don't even know what I'm talking about and uh, I'll be extra mad during the edit but right now it's just fun <laughs> and I need a coffee Professional YouTubers are taking a bureau before they enter a coffee shop. Hey, I'm talking. Disrespectful. But I just want coffee. Why is that so bad? Just a coffee without a bureau. Okay, fine. A short bureau just for you here. Was that bureau fast enough for you? I got a coffee. And this is a real good coffee. <laughs> hot so now that I'm here in DC I can go and check out how is the Turkish cuisine because that's the best rated restaurant in this area and uh, that's where I'm going breakfast lunch dinner there is unlimited mimosa so this is my fourth one and I'm kind of getting buzzy cheers <laughs> life is life, life, is life. So I paid for my lunch, breakfast, and uh, I started to walk out from the from the restaurant. And one guy stopped me and asked me if uh, if I paid or if I'm stealing. And uh, <laughs> yeah, it uh, it was one of those uh, restaurants where you go with a tie and a suit. And I just walked in like this. But hey, I have money. Like <laughs> I'm not the fucking cheapest. Yeah, that probably wasn't the best place for me to hang out. So I came to a hipster coffee shop and, uh, and I have a new coffee again. Coffee number three. I don't know what am I doing. Uh, I had this coffee now and uh, my buddy's back, so he's here. What's up? What's the plan? <laughs> What's this green stuff? It's a mojito. <laughs> he ordered his coffee and his salad together. <laughs> All right, so uh, plan for the rest of the day. We'll figure it out. Worst case scenario, this is the end of the vlog. Bye, nice coffee shop. <laughs> It happened to me the first time when a guy walks out from the restroom and he was holding... Okay, all right, yeah, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> and he was holding the door for me and I'm like, thank you, sir. And he responded to me like, I'm not a sir. Well, here, I'm from a, I'm from a freaking village, York, Pennsylvania, Harrisburg. That's a village. If you have a bigger beard than me, then you're a sir for me, right? I don't want to go home. Let's just stay here for the night. So what if we just stay in DC and uh, we just go in a hotel and we go out party tonight? Uh, no, no parties for me. So this is the room where we're gonna stay for tonight. <laughs> That's my bed. This is yours. Okay. And we go to drink. phone died so everything else will just remain a secret see you tomorrow and I'm back I guess I really have to put a conclusion at the end of this video because the storyline just went everywhere and oh my but here's my explanation when you're writing a diary you're writing it at the end of the day uh, you might have a couple pictures that you can attach to the story but Basically that's it. Now if modern vlogs are basically video diaries, you have to record everything and then you're doing the post writing during the edit. And this can be hard because you can lose the story of the whole video. But 
I guess you don't have to focus on that. And here's the catch and here's what I'm doing. Because I cannot focus on the story when I'm going out to have fun. I will only focus on the having fun part. Because that's what I'm going to appreciate in 5 years when I look back at my old videos. So I guess it's okay to mix up your channel with scripted and improvised videos. But is it really? Let me know your opinion in the comment section below, please. And with that said, peace and love, I'm out. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.